It's back. That's right, this week marked the return of the Jack Bauer Power Hour, the Guess How Many Terrorists Next Get Snapped in 60 Minutes show, or as people that are not me like to call it, 24. Anyway, the return of 24 got me thinking. The series is well known for having some pretty intense and controversial interrogation scenes, many of which have likely influenced certain scenes in video games. So, let's take a look at my picks for the top 5 most intense interrogation scenes in video games. Number 5. Warning. Metal Gear Solid spoilers incoming in 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. We're going to play a game, Solid Snake. And we'll find out what kind of man you really are. When the pain becomes too great to bear, just give up and your suffering will end. But if you The do, actual content of Metal Gear Solid's torture scene isn't all that special. I mean, it's your cliche, guy gets strapped to an electric chair and zapped until he breaks. But what makes this scene so intense is the consequence of failure. Whether or not you're able to press the button fast enough to avoid surrendering to Ocelot's torture is the determining factor of whether Meryl lives or dies in the ending. Number 4 Who sent you? Fuck you! Splinter Cell Conviction took interrogations to another level by letting the player play the part of the interrogator, and replaced the traditional interrogation room with any enclosed area that a bad guy was foolish enough to get himself stuck in with a vengeful Sam Fisher. And it also replaced the traditional interrogation tools with anything that Sam could smash someone's face into, or anything that could be smashed into someone's face. Number 3 I have nothing to gain by talking to you. Short and not so sweet, especially for the guy who's got a shard of glass stuffed in his mouth, Black Ops made us all squirm during a particularly tough to swallow scene involving the interrogation of Daniel Clark, made even more painful by the fact that the player is the one pulling the trigger for each punch. Number 2 Warning Bioshock Infinite Burial at Sea Episode 2 Spoilers in 5, 4, 3, 2, 1. Here we go. You feel that? I'm moving the pick across your eyeball, still now, and resting it on your skull. Ugh. This scene was just hard to watch. After being captured by Atlas, Elizabeth finds herself with a pick in her eye socket, with Atlas slowly tapping the pick deeper and deeper into her skull. A transorbital lobotomy, he calls it. Every time he gets an answer he doesn't like, the pick gets tapped deeper and deeper into her skull, and we feel every single tap of the hammer. When Atlas seems convinced that the answers he wants aren't in Elizabeth's brain, he turns his attention elsewhere. Please! Number one. Now our friend here, he claims he doesn't know I anything. Don't, I don't know anything. I don't know. I already told nothing. Nothing. I don't know anything. Please. Please. Sir. You know about the Azerbaijanis. Huh? Azerbaijanis. I do audiovisual, high fi audiovisual. It's top man, good price, VIP. You know? So, you're so. a fucking spy. When you're the most controversial portion of a game like GTA 5, you know that's saying a lot. The torture scene in GTA 5 is especially uncomfortable since you're the one who's actually selecting the tools to use on this poor guy. Even a psychopath like Trevor doesn't feel comfortable with the suffering he's putting this poor guy through. Still, it makes for one hell of a memorable scene and my number one pick for the most intense interrogation scene in video games. And there you have it, my picks for the top 5 most intense interrogations in video games. What do you think? Did we miss any? Let us know in the comments and please don't forget to like, comment, and subscribe.